You did tell her I was coming, didn't you? Of course I did. I told her to lay another place at the table. <laughs> Confusion reigns in May to December when Alec takes Zoe to meet his daughter. And you know my brother as long as I have, you learn not to believe a thing he tells you. Jamie's not my boyfriend. Oh, well, whatever it is you want to call it. I may be a vicar's wife, Zoe, but I hope I'm not a prude. <laughs> May to December, tonight at 7.15 on BBC One. Well, back to this afternoon, and at 4.45, there's a chance to see the remaining entries for this year's Eurovision Song Contest in the second preview, introduced by Ken Bruce. Now on one, the acting and singing talents of Bing Crosby, Grace Kelly and Frank Sinatra, plus some well-known songs by Cole Porter, combined to bring us a musical extravaganza in our film matinee, High Society. Tomorrow afternoon at 1.45, Omar Sharif heads a distinguished cast in David Lean's Oscar-winning film, Dr. Zhivago. Space, the final frontier. These are the continuing voyages of the Starship Enterprise. Star Trek III, the search for Spock. Why did you leave him on Genesis? Spock trusted you. And you denied him his future. But Genesis holds more than one secret. You seize the secret of this weapon. The secret of ultimate power. Success. A quest across the galaxy in the search for Spock, Star Trek III, tomorrow at 8.25 on one. Rugby special starting on two in 15 minutes presents the highlights of the cup final between Bath and Leicester. Here on One, Ken Bruce previews the remaining entries for this year's Eurovision Song Contest. Good afternoon. Once again, we whisk you on a British Sunday afternoon off to the peaceful beauty of a Swiss Sunday afternoon. For in only six days' time in Lausanne, we'll see the nearest we get to battle in Europe these days, the Eurovision Song Contest. This year is the 34th competition, and like the first, it's being hosted by Switzerland. So shortly, the singers, musicians, and dare we say it, the broadcasters from each participating country will be doing their best to dodge the trams in Lausanne, this historic city. 22 countries are taking part. If you were with us last week, you already have seen 11 of them. The other 11 songs, including our own, are coming your way over the next 40 minutes. So let's take up where we left off in the competition running order, a video that could be an advertisement for coffee, deodorant, frozen dinners, almost anything in fact. As it happens, it's selling the Austrian song in the contest. The translated title is Song of Love, and the boy behind the piano is Thomas Forstner. <laughs> 